Hi, I'm John from Audi and today I'll present the all new Audi A4 sedan for you. And I'll start with the design, of course the exterior design. The new A4 includes Audi's single frame front grille, so the central design element at the front of the car which features on every Audi across the range today. Also, this Audi A4 a 3.2 uh, V6 that you see here has standard Xenon headlights, by Xenon headlights, and here you'll see a strip of LED lights within the headlight. This is our daytime driving light, and when illuminated, gives a very striking presence to the front end of the new A4. Also, we have uh, grills positioned low and wide at the front, and this gives us a very wide and powerful stance, and uh, again, presence at the front end. Moving to the side of the new A4 sedan, there's a few lines that we we talk about in terms of design. One is the shoulder line, which is the clear, distinct line running along the shoulder of the car all the way from front to rear. And as you can see there, just slopes into the single frame front grille and headlight area there. And here we have the dynamic line, which starts at the lower edge of the front guard. And the dynamic, dynamic line gently rises to the rear of the car and meets rises to the rear and meets at the rear bumper area and uh, then travels up into the shoulder line and then you can see joins the integrated boot spoiler. And here while we're at the side of the car we'll talk about the all new running gear for the A4. The all new running gear for the A4. The engineers uh, have managed to shift the front axle quite a way forward. Uh, this does a couple of things for us. It uh, shortens uh, the front overhang, uh, which gives a good sporty appearance to the car, uh, but it also improves the weight distribution front to rear, moving that front axle forward. Uh, this essentially brings the engine back as well, so all of that aiding in the weight distribution, giving a very nice balance to the car. They've also uh, uh, brand new developments with the steering as well. The main steering rack uh, is now positioned very very low and forward directly in line with the front axle so we end up with a very precise direct steering on the new A4 and moving to the rear uh, in terms of design you'll see clear horizontal lines so with the rear bumper the boot lid and the uh, integrated uh, contrasting diffuser now this gives us a very wide and powerful appearance to the back end of the new A4 sedan. The boot, a very large boot with standard uh, split fold rear seats uh, for, for brilliant versatility. There's also room enough for, for two sets of clubs, uh, golf clubs that is, uh, fitting sideways along the back of the car within the boot. And the rear end is finished off nicely with the uh, dual chrome exhaust pipes there for this 3.2 engine. Uh, this A4 3.2 has standard 18-inch uh, alloy wheels and uh, quite a large braking system. Uh, we have, of course, as standard in this car, an ESP system, which is an electronic stability program. This incorporates uh, ABS, uh, anti-skid braking, and also incorporates EDL, electronic diff lock, uh, as well as brake assist for extra assistance uh, under emergency braking situations. Moving to the inside of the new A4 sedan, you see a brand new interior design. And you'll see, um, sitting behind the driver's seat of the new A4, it's a very driver-focused uh, experience, if you like. The centre console is, uh, is very, uh, quite high and wide and flows into the, the instrument panel. Uh, we have a standard uh, six and a half inch colour monitor, which is at perfect eye level. And here you'll see uh, the displays for the radio, telephone, navigation system, etc. Uh, in that centre console there, you'll also see uh, uh, a quite a large uh, central knob. This is the Audi MMI, the multimedia interface, and this is where we can control quite easily and very conveniently all the infotainment features like radio, telephone, navigation, and various vehicle settings as well. We also have an electromechanical parking brake. Uh, this, this means that we don't have a mechanical handbrake lever as such, we have a, a very conveniently located button uh, for the, the handbrake operation. 
the A4 uh, externally and internally has grown in, in pretty much all areas in terms of uh, uh, length and width to the car and this gives us more interior space as well uh, in the front and rear of the car. This car features a very high level of standard equipment from electric seats, three zone air conditioning, of course power front and rear windows, a sport steering wheel with multi-function and, uh, and shift paddles at that steering wheel as well, just to name a few items of standard equipment. As well we have uh, a Bang & Olufsen sound system fitted as an option to this car which gives us 14 uh, loudspeakers with over 505 watts of power. And moving to the heart of the new A4 which is of course its engine. In this case the 3.2 engine with the FSI. Um, FSI is Audi's direct petrol injection technology. Direct petrol injection uh, essentially gives us more power for every drop of fuel uh, by injecting the, the fuel directly into the combustion chamber. Right by the spark plug we get the optimum uh, combustion uh, within the cylinder for optimum engine performance. So here we have 195 kilowatts of power, 330 newton meters of torque and, uh, and this engine is coupled to Audi's uh, Quattro all-wheel drive system, our, our permanent all-wheel drive system in this case and uh, in, in, this is the new generation of Quattro permanent all-wheel drive from Audi and uh, the new generation means that we now divert more power to the rear axle so under normal driving conditions we have 60% of engine torque uh, to the rear axle and around 40% to the front and this can vary depending on certain driving conditions for example uh, if we were to give full acceleration from a standing start uh, the system could divert up to 85% of uh, torque to the rear axle and vice versa. If we were decelerating we could uh, uh, transmit more torque to the front axle and this really gives us a perfect balance with the Quattro permanent all-wheel drive system and this whole Quattro system it's torque sensing and purely mechanical uh, so it's a, a brilliant driving experience from in terms of the new running gear the Quattro permanent all-wheel drive and the 3.2 FSI. So that was a brief summary of the new Audi A4 sedan.